the entrance antiphon. Your merciful love, O God, we have received in the midst of your temple. Your praise, O God, like your name, reaches the ends of the earth. Your right hand is filled with your saving justice. Good morning. I was meant to have a priest come in, but they didn't come in. It's a good job I was here. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with all of you. We just pause for a moment now, asking the Lord to remove all the worries and the distractions from our minds. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and what I failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask, Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. O God, who in the abasement of your Son have raised up a fallen world, fill your faithful with holy joy, for on those you have rescued from the slavery to sin, you bestowed eternal gladness through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the book of prophet Hosea. Thus says the Lord, when Israel was a child, I loved him. Out of Egypt I called my son, the more I called them, the farther they went from me, sacrificing to the Baals and burning incense to idols. Yet it was I who taught Ephraim to walk, who took them in my arms, and I drew them with human cords with bands of love. I fostered them like one who raises an infant to his cheeks. Yet though I stooped to feed my child, they did not know that I was their healer. My heart was overwhelmed, my pity stirred. I will not give vent to my blazing anger. I will not destroy Ephraim again, for I am God and not man, the Holy One present among you. I will not let the flames consume you. The word of the Lord. The responsorial psalm. Let us see your face, Lord, and we shall be saved. O shepherd of Israel, hearken. From your throne upon the cherubim, shine forth and rouse your power. Let us see your face, Lord, and we shall be saved. Once again, O Lord of hosts, look down from heaven and see. Take care of this vine and protect what your right hand has planted, the son of man whom you made strong for yourself. Let us see your face, and Lord, and we shall be saved. Alleluia, 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 alleluia. Alleluia. If today you hear his voice, harden not your hearts. Alleluia. 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 The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. 
A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Jesus said to his apostles, As you go, make this proclamation. The kingdom of heaven is at hand. Cure the sick, raise the dead, cleanse the lepers, drive out demons. Without cost you have received, without cost you are to give. Do not take gold or silver or copper for your belts, no sack for the journey or a second tunic or sandals or walking stick. The laborer deserves his keep. Whatever town or village you enter, look for a worthy person in it and stay there until you leave. As you enter a house, wish it peace. If the house is worthy, let your peace come upon it. If not, let your peace return to you. Whoever will not receive you or listen to your words, go outside that house or town and shake the dust from your feet. And when I say to you, it will be more tolerable for the land of Sodom and Gomorrah on the day of judgment than for that town. The Gospel of the Lord. This is when Jesus was sending out the apostles and instructing them what to do. But he tells them very clearly, if a house, wherever you enter, let your peace come upon it. If not, in other words, if they're troublesome or arguing with you, let your peace return to you. Whoever will not receive you or listen to your words, says even go outside that house or town, shake the dust from your feet and move on. Why did he give those specific words? You and I know that maybe in your families you spoke about religion. And maybe it was not taken the way you would like it to be. What happens next? Come on now, you know. Another war starts up in the house. He was trying to tell them Satan would want to get in between the apostles and whoever he's speaking to. But he's making it very clearly, if they don't accept your words, just move off. Others will later on. I often say the only way that you're going to get through to your families are those who are closest to you. A lot of times talking and trying to tell them what to do doesn't work. Sometimes it may, other times it doesn't. If it doesn't, you stay quiet. Because if you don't, Satan is going to get in there and make the situation worse than the beginning. The words are very clearly, this is 2,000 years ago, but it has not changed because human nature has not changed. Let your peace come upon it, meaning those who you're speaking to, if not, let your peace return to you. You know very clearly, when we lose our peace, it is very difficult to even pray. We cannot pray. So we have to be patient. Most times, unfortunately, that goes right across the board. The only way, as I say, when it comes to the family, as regards religion, you pray for them at a distance. At a distance. Or by your example, 
Unfortunately, the words won't go very far. Amen? Let us humbly now on this Thursday morning raise our hearts, our minds to our Heavenly Father as we bring the needs before him. For all members of the church, may the Lord bless us with an abundance of divine goodness. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord For law enforcement officers and all first responders, may they operate under the benevolent protection of Christ. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For those riddled by anxiety, may the peace of the Lord give them solace. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the young people in our community, may God stir in their hearts a deep love and reverence for him. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For those who have died, may perpetual light shine upon them, and may they rest in peace. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. And today's Mass is being offered up for Lionel Santos. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Just pause for a moment in the silence of your own hearts. Father, you know the needs in the hearts of all who are present here and those who are listening in the airwaves. We bring all our prayers before you through the intercession of the Blessed Mother, Saint Joseph, Saint Anthony, Saint Paul, Saint Andrew, as we say the Hail Mary together. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you fruit of the earth and work of human hands to become for us the bread of life. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands, become our spiritual drink. Pray, brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May this oblation dedicated to your name purify us, O Lord, and day by day bring our conduct closer to the life of heaven through Christ our Lord. The Lord be with you. And with your Lift up your hearts. Lift up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, for although you have no need of our praise, yet our thanksgiving is itself your gift since our praise adds nothing to your greatness, but profits us for salvation through Christ our Lord. And so in the company with all the choirs of angels, we praise you and with joy we proclaim.
You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fountain of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks broke it and gave it to his disciples saying, take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples saying, take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith, when we eat this bread and drink this cup, we proclaim your death, O Lord, until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you've held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you, Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, Edgar, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who've fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy, welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the blessed apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with it, him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray from every evil graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress 
as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. May the peace of the Lord be with you always. This is Jesus, the risen Lord, the healer. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, Lord I am not. May the body of Christ keep me safe for eternal life. At this time, you can make a spiritual communion. I love you, O oh my God. I cannot receive you in holy communion. Come, nevertheless, and visit me with your graces. Come spiritually into my heart. Purify it. Sanctify it. Render it like unto your own. Amen.
Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to your protection, implored your help, or sought your intercession was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, I fly unto thee, O virgins of virgins, my mother. To you do we come, before you we stand, sinful and sorrowful. O mother of the Word incarnate, despise not our petitions, but in your mercy hear and answer them. Amen. O Mary, conceive without sin. May the heart of Jesus in the most blessed sacrament be praised, adored, and loved with grateful affection at every moment in all the tabernacles of the world, even to the end of time. Amen. Saint Michael, the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and the snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the heavenly host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl around the world seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Let us pray. Grant, we pray, O Lord, that having been replenished by such great gifts, we may gain the prize of salvation and never cease to praise you through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended now. Go in peace and love to serve the Lord. Thank you. We will now have benediction and the rosary. Lord, you are here with us this morning. You see into the hearts of all who are present. We come before you again, asking for your mercy, asking for your help. Too many times we try to do it alone and forget that you are with us, that you want us to come to you. Lord, we just thank you for the gift of faith that draws us to you. 
despite of our own weaknesses. We ask this morning the intercession of the Mother of God for all the intentions in your hearts, all those that we are praying for, especially the sick and the dying, Take away any fear now, Lord, from anyone this morning. Any anxiety, Lord. Anything that holds us back from you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. I believe in God, the Father, the Almighty, the Creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son, O Lord, who was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead, and on the third day he arose again, and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. We offer three Hail Marys for an increase in the virtues of faith, hope, and charity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The five luminous mysteries. The first mystery is the baptism of Jesus in the Jordan River. The fruit of the mystery is openness to the Holy Spirit. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, now, and shall be O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially. The second luminous mystery is the wedding at Cana. The fruit of the mystery is to Jesus, true Mary. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us in the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy. The third luminous mystery is the proclamation of the kingdom. The fruit of the mystery is repentance and the trust in God. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh, my Jesus. The fourth luminous mystery is the transfiguration. The fruit of the mystery is desire for holiness. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O my Jesus. Amen. 
the fifth luminous mystery is the institution of the Eucharist. The fruit of the mystery is adoration. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us in the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need it. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, O banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping this valley of tears. And then, most gracious advocate, thy eyes of mercy towards us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God. For the Pope's intentions and for the indulgence this day. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Most sacred heart of Jesus. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.
have given them bread from heaven. Let us pray. O God, who in his wonderful sacrament left us a memorial of your passion, grant, we implore you, to venerate the sacred mysteries of your body and blood, as always to be conscious of the fruit of your redemption, you who live and reign forever and ever. The divine praises. Blessed be God. Blessed, Blessed be his holy name. Blessed, Blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man. Blessed, Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed, Blessed be his most sacred heart. Blessed be his most precious blood. Blessed be Jesus and the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Blessed be the great Mother of God, Mary most holy. Blessed be our holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be our glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, our most chaste spouse. Blessed be God and his angels and in his saints. May the heart of Jesus in the most blessed sacrament be praised, adored and loved with grateful affection at every moment in all the tabernacles of the world, even till the end of time. Amen. Thank you for your presence and participation. May the day be one of peace and health for all of you. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you.